Oh, folks, it is Division Smackdown time, and I am up against my good friend, the G-Meister. So, we've made a gentleman's agreement for a couple of things. Uh, it's that we won't use either, or we won't use any tier 1s, or, or any tier 2s, and uh, <clears throat> we're not going to use any EV lights. So with that in mind, here's what the team's looking like for this week. The name, I suppose. We're starting off with a very cheesy little Venonat here. Giving it HP so it can make a 6 HP sub. With decent bulk, and giving it a good amount of speed to get the jump on things and fire off the sleep powder. And then after that, I can either can just set up a sub and baton pass out, hopefully getting a couple turns of sleep instead of just one, so I can safely get something in. Or I can just take some damage with Sludge Bomb, if need be. Here's one of the things that could greatly benefit from Sleep Powder, and that is Nasty Plot Sinistee, with the weak armor for the physical hits, and White Herb. So uh, I don't get too owned by a defense drop. I've got Nasty Plot, Shadow Ball, Giga Drain, and Psychic. I'm running Psychic over Stored Power because if I'm not boosted, or if I don't have boosted speed, I don't want to lose. I don't want to lose out on Stored Power. Or I'm not a big Psychic hit, so I might as well just use well fucking Psychic. And it's good for Stuffle. Especially, the Stuffle can easily take these two attacks because it's immune to Shadow Ball and neutral to Giga Drain. So Psychic's gonna absolutely light it up. Amora, Breeze Dry, Earth Power, T Wave, and Hyper Voice. Pretty standard set here. Honestly, not really special. Rile with the Heavy Duty Boots. Brave Bird, Defog, Roost, and Knock Off, kind of just a support set. Because I don't really want to be hazard spammed at all. Not that he really has a lot of hazards, but I just don't want rocks up. Because it can really mess with these two. And I really don't want Grimer taking too much extra damage. Just not a fan of that. Now here, here's one of my favorite sets. If I can get uh, a sub and a baton pass, and give this boy a sub, it's gonna belly drum. It's got okay speed. I think 14 isn't too bad. This is low tiers. They're kind of fast, but at the same time, they're not always the speediest, like frillish. I doubt he's gonna run the Scarf Water Spout this week. Voltorb can't really hurt me. Boltoy can't really hurt me and also doesn't always run max speed. Codepine and Spinarak are really slow. Gumi is really slow. And along with Stuffle, most likely not gonna be 14 speed. So I definitely think I can exploit this team very well with Cubone. Uh, hitting 28 attack and with the belly drum would put me over 100, which is kind of crazy. The only problem is I don't recover at all, so I'm a little suspect susceptible to priority. And then finally, another very funny set, Orenberry, Alolan Grimer, with a very interesting EV spread, I must say. The knockoff, Fire Blast, Belch, Giga Drain. It's just kind of funny. Belch is really a very, very rare move. You don't see it used very often. And for good reason, it's not great. Being locked behind eating a berry, or a move that isn't even perfect accuracy, isn't great. But hey, 120 base power is not, nothing to scoff at. And yet you could say, oh, just use Gunk Shot and you got the 30% poison chance. Well, to that I say, no. I'm cool, I'm using Belch. And also, it's week 5, so it's the week where you're supposed to basically meme around. Because it's uh, the Division Smackdown, so these don't count for actual standings. Like for wins, loss, differential, and whether or not I make playoffs. What they do count for is Pokemon kills. And that's what I'm going to try to get here. Hopefully get Sinisty some kills, along with Amora and maybe even Rowlet. It'd be great to see Cubone get a belly drum off and do some 
absolutely fantastic damage. So I'm just gonna pause the video and cut to the battle. Hopefully we win. Alright, here we are in the battle. Yeah, we got we got the low tier gods out here. Definitely happy with what I see. bad boy in live battles, even though I don't think Porygon works. And it doesn't. Perfect. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll give him a Venonat, Venonat lead. <laughs> oh, he hit me with the okay gill. <laughs> Venonat should be pretty good against everything. I don't know. The only thing I'd be even remotely scared of is... No, it's not this, I'll tell you that. And a swap out would be great. Volt switch is good too. That might be specs. I'm not gonna calc, I'm not calcing anything in week 5. Beast of Fear? Fear Gare, what do you go into right now? I mean, you don't know what I'm gonna click. Yeah, went safe with the ball toy, but could I put it to sleep? Do a sub job on him. Hard frillish. Hmm. I'll get a more in safely, why not? Oh, okay. I'll take chip on Squilliam. Oh, did it miss? He's got the blunder policy. That is some heat right there. Hopefully he doesn't have the ice beam. Oh, blizzard! <laughs> Alright. Um, hmm. It's probably got a ghost moon. Indeed, I am quite owned. Hit him up with a giga with a missile giga drain right here. Oh, here we go! Here we go! The fire blast. That's in thirty. Damn. Oh, I thought I'd live. I don't really know why I thought I'd live, but I I thought I. Fourteen, it did thirty. Hmm. I don't know what priority any of those get. So I'm just gonna say I win. Big <laughs> boy, no be. You know, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> That's such a horrifying shiny. Interesting. This somehow has priority. Yeah, I didn't think so. Watch it be scarfed Voltorb. Oh my god. 
I am owned. Hmm. And that seems like a lot. Like, Voltorb isn't that strong. I thought it would kill. I'll just hyper voice. Squillium is sure to die. I think this probably dies to a hyper voice. It took 30 from non stab Giga Drain from a weaker special attacker. It's gonna be close, but I think this kills. Holy fucking shit, focus punch. Simply outplayed. I just have to. I just have to click power or not power. I have to click belly drum. <laughs> One hundred and twelve attack. I probably die if you if he wakes up. I die, but one hundred and twelve attack. <laughs> oh my! Oh no! I wonder if Gumi will live. Yeah, I'm not not a coward, I'm using Bone Meringue. What an interesting battle. I'm, I'm just glad that the fucking belly drum. <laughs> ow, chicka, ow, ow. Yeah, he, he did get bone. Yeah, that was a fun battle. Glad I got to used pretty much every Pokemon. Yeah, every, everything saw the field. I just didn't get to belch with Grimer like I wanted to. And I guess Rowlet didn't do much, but overall, quite a good one. So, I'll see you next time. Oh, stay thick and safe. We'll be going up against... Let's see. Okay. So going up against Jaw, gonna be a tough one. Yeah, stay thick and safe, and I'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.